Ashoka University. Sample paper, uh, economic section, question number seven. So this is a question on uh, monopoly and uh, price discrimination. So the marginal cost is zero and the fixed cost is 500. If films are shown or the theater is operating and, if, and it's zero if theater is not operating. So marginal cost is basically, um, it's, it's zero. Now the uh, demand for a theater is given by this and uh, this demand is for students and this is the demand for non-students. Now we have to find what is the optimal quantity of uh, tickets sold to students and non-students respectively. So it's possible to price discriminate in this case because you can take the IDs of students and you can charge a lower price from students. Okay, Only if you charge a lower price can you price discriminate. You cannot uh, ask for a student ID and then charge a higher price. So it's only possible to either charge the same price from students and non-students or to charge a lower price to students. So assuming we are going to charge a lower price of students, this is a simple case of price discrimination. So the profits of the monopoly are going to be separate and the prices are going to be separate into two different, smart, different markets. So this is market one, this is the market for students. So let's uh, take out the profit of the monopolist if he sells uh, a different price ticket to the students. So that means um, our, our, if uh, rewriting the, quant the demand function, we get PS is equal to 220 minus QS by 40. So profit is going to be PS into QS, which is going to be 220 minus QS by 40 into QS and d pi by dqs uh, putting that equal to zero so we get 220 minus 2qs by 40 is equal to zero so this gives me 220 minus 2qs is equal to zero so qs is equal to 110 similarly doing for qn uh, profit is going to be pn into qn so pn is going to be 140 minus qn by 20 into qn and then d pi by dqn is going to be 140 minus 2qn is equal to 0 and 1qn uh, is going to be equal to 70. So this is qn, this is qs. Now the only thing that we need to check is the prices. So PS is uh, 220 minus 110 by 40. So that is going to be 110 by 40, which is going to be uh, 11 by 4, which is going to be something like 5.5 over 2. And uh, PN is going to be 140 minus 70 by 20, which is going to be 70 by 20, which is going to be uh, 7 by 2. So 7 by 2 and 5.5 by 2. So we can see that the price charged by uh, charge to students is 5.5 by 2. And the price charged to non-students is 7 by 2. So the price charged to students is lower. So these quantities are correct. So QS is 110 and QN is 70. And that is our answer right here. The answer is A as given to us by Ashoka also.